Hey, how's it going? Rakeem Madison here, and on today's video, I wanna share with you six tips to being more productive. Now, with that being said, if you haven't yet subscribed to my YouTube channel and you wanna learn how to build an online income, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. And if you wanna be updated anytime that I release any new videos, just go ahead, tick the bell icon right after you subscribe. Now, I wanna go ahead and transition into, you know, giving you those six tips to being more productive. Now, what I wanna do first though, is I wanna ask you a question. And that question is this, what can you do today to further your progress to your dreams and your goals, right? What can you do today? And what I want you to do is just go ahead and uh, comment uh, what you would do today to further your progress, you know, to your dreams and goals. Just uh, go ahead and comment that, you know, below in the comments. All right, so with that being said, we're gonna uh, go ahead and uh, talk a little bit about those tips. All right, so the first tip is this, right? You want to wake up earlier, right? Now, the reason that I say you wanna wake up earlier is because there was actually a study that the most successful people wake up between five and 6 a.m., right? Between five and 6 a.m., right? So if the most successful people are waking up between those hours, you might wanna, you know, kinda, Put together, put together like a schedule for yourself, you know, to get up within the early, you know, the wee hours, right? Now, I'll explain to you a little bit further why, and it kind of goes into the second tip, right? So I actually wrote these down, so I'll be looking at my notes from time to time. All right, so the second one is, you wanna have, after you wake up in early in the morning, you wanna have an hour of power, right? Now, this, I, I use an hour of power, it doesn't have to actually be an hour, but what you wanna do is you wanna use, I don't know, 15, 30, or an hour to work on your personal development, right? Because if you're not working on personal development, you're dying, right? Because if you're not doing that, that means you're not growing, right? So if you're not growing, you're dying. All right, so you wanna use that time to work on personal development, like listening to audios, reading books, uh, listening to some type of motivational video or audio that pumps you up, you know, in the morning. So, you know, you're not taking in the negativity that we hear on the radio, uh, the news and all those different types of things. Right. So that was the second thing you want. First thing was you want to wake up between five and six a.m. Or at least just wake up earlier so you can accomplish a lot more before the day begins. All right. And the second thing was. Um, your hour of power just having your time to work on personal development now the next thing is get started at the same time every single day so that goes into consistency which is very important when it comes to building a business and in life in general right if you want to achieve something in your life then it all goes back to consistency so get started at the same time every single day right all right so the next thing is um, you want to do income producing activities, right? So if you're a business owner, you want to, on top of waking up early, you want to accomplish the most that you can within, you know, the, the wee hours, you know, the wee hours, you know what I mean? So when, with you doing that, you're allowing so so if you're I don't know maybe you're you're a video marketer or you do blog posts or you do Facebook posts or like free traffic right when you do those things within the morning what you're doing is you're hitting people as they're waking up right or as they're going to their job right you're going to be hitting those people and they're going to be interacting now if you think about it you've already accomplished a lot more than the average entrepreneur right somebody who doesn't wake up until seven or eight right because there are people that are doing that and you know in my opinion i mean i just feel like and i actually do it myself i just feel like waking up early you're able to accomplish so much more all right so that was number four you want to do income producing activities and i'll kind of just give you a quick example of what that is so uh you you upload a video in the morning right so it's hitting people right when they're going. Or you do a couple of Facebook group posts, right, if you're trying to generate some traffic. Or you post a few ads on Facebook or Bing ads or Google ads. There's a bunch of different things that you can do, but you always wanna be focused on the income producing activities and not the time wasting activities, which I've, I've, like I said, I've been there too, so I'm not judging anybody, but if you're not doing income producing activities as I just spoke of, then you're really setting yourself up for failure. All right, so 
Tip number five, you want to schedule a stop time. Now, now why do you want to do this? So let's say you're a family guy. Me, I'm a family guy. See my ring right there, right? That's my, uh, I'm married and I have two boys, right? So if I was to come home from my job, as you can see what my job is, right? I'm in the military. If I was to come home and just go straight on my computer and work on my business, like constantly without saying anything to anybody, not, say, not, not doing anything, but just going straight to my computer, what do you think that's gonna, what, 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 what kind of impact do you think that's gonna have on you and your relationship with your family, right? And I'm speaking to you and I'm, I'm telling you this from experience. So when I first got started in business, um, obviously, you know, I was still having, I, I'm a family guy and I was still, you know, having some time with my family, but I found myself going to the, the laptop a lot more, right? I pretty much came home from, from my job and then I would eat, you know, kind of converse with the wife a little bit, you know, a little play with the kids and then I was right on it, right? Now, some may say that's just you, you know, um, that's just you, you know, putting in the work, right? But then others, you know, like family people, I'm a family oriented guy, right? So in order for me to, um, in order for me to have success in my business and as well as have success uh, with a successful uh, family relationship, the only way that I'm gonna do that is I have to schedule my time, right? Because it can literally take a hold of you and I'm telling you from experience, right? So schedule your time off. So let's say uh, you're gonna work from, I don't know, seven to, seven to nine o'clock at night, right? So two hours, right? You wanna stick to that schedule, right? You wanna stick to that schedule each and every day, right? Because it's gonna allow you, let's say you get off work at about 4.30, 5 o'clock, now that gives you about two hours you can spend with the wife and the kids, right? So I'm just kinda of giving you a little insight on what I'm doing nowadays. Like I said, I'm just being honest. When I first got started, I was full force in, right? And I'm still full force in, but I, I time my, uh, you know, when I'm gonna be working on my business, right? So that's very important. All right, so the uh, tip number six, you wanna plan your time off, right? So the best example I can give for you with this, now I'm a video marketer, right? And video is one of the things that um, I do to generate most of the traffic that I have coming into my businesses, right? Now, I want you to kind of think about it, right? So as a, visit, a video marketer, if you're someone who's doing videos every single day, right? You're doing videos every single day or you're doing them three times a week either way it still takes you some time to do editing right you also have to make sure i mean I, I won't get too much into like the quality of your video which that does matter because you know not everybody is going to be want to watch like a video that has you know crappy quality right nobody really wants to watch that but sometimes it, it's just really about the message so that doesn't really matter but i kind of want you to just think about it as a video marketer, you have to put out consistent videos to generate traffic, right? Now, if you're someone who's, you never take time off, right? You never set aside time to accomplish things, you're going to become burnt out. And that goes, it goes the same along with just an entrepreneur in general. Like, if you never give yourself a break, right? If you never give yourself a break, you're not, you're going to become like burnt out. And you're not going to even want to do anything. And I've been there time and time again as a video marketer because when you're putting out consistent content and you, you just, you're constantly going, like you're just constantly going at it, you're going to burn out. I promise you, you will burn out. Whether you have a lot of ideas or whatever, you will burn yourself out. All right. So with that being said, um, like I said, I, I gave you a little bit of a question in the beginning of this video and that question was this, just to give you a reminder. What will you what can you do today to further your progress towards your dreams and your goals? Right? So if you didn't leave, if you didn't leave a comment as of yet, just leave a comment down below letting me know, you know, uh, you know, what is it gonna take for you to get to where you wanna go, right? So think about today as you're going on to the rest of your day, just think about what can you do today to further your further your progress towards your dreams and your goals now with that being said um, if you got value from this video just go ahead and smash the like button and like i said if you haven't subscribed to my channel and you want to keep receiving content just like this 
be sure to smash that subscribe button as well as tick the bell icon to be notified anytime that I release any new videos. So with that being said, I look forward to seeing you in the next video, my friend. Peace.